<laughs> How about you start the video today? Hey, say what's up everybody. We're gonna make bug screens today. <laughs> Cruz, tell him. Tell him. Say, bug screens. Look how big he's getting. This is like no joke anymore. Hey, you're no longer a little baby puppy. Tell everybody we're making bug screens. <laughs> All right, guys, what's up? Today we're going to be making bug screens for the van. When I say we, that doesn't mean me because I'm probably not going to do anything but film because when it comes to like thread and a needle and me, ain't going to happen. You need to look like you're equipped to make bug screens in order to be able to sew and make bug screens. And well, if you're a sewer, this is the kind of attire that you're gonna wear. You always have to have, boom, a measuring tape for a collar. <laughs> is that one long one or two? That's one long one. <sighs> All right, this is the gentleman that's gonna be making yep. the bug screens today. <laughs> you can have this one. All right, thanks. And you can have this one. Thanks. <laughs> we are actually gonna be sewing, or he's actually gonna be sewing out here, we're in Lillooet, BC. So freaking amazing. He's got a great little office all set up here. Is that firewood your seat? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Look at this. A full blown sewing setup out here in the middle of the woods. Let's do it. All right, Mr. Joseph, what's the plan? Well, I'm gonna start on the top with the snaps and just get it all in. And then I'm just right now just figuring out the base. So I might turn it. Is it right now? Oh, damn. All right, so I'm attempting to make French toast in my van for the very first time, and somebody else might eat a piece of it. That's what scares the crap out of me. <laughs> cooking for myself is one thing. Cooking when someone else has to eat it is another, but I added cinnamon to it, and that'll mask any flaws. Isn't that the trick? Add spices to cover up anything that tastes like shit? Sounds good to me. That's Chromie's cooking policies. If you know it's going to taste like shit, put some spices in it. Problem solved. Ooh, that looks good. What did you say? That's pretty good. Nice. Did I pay you to say that? No. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> that section. This is looking amazing. Wow. It's probably a better sew job than the bottom side of this. Here's the side that came from the manufacturer. 
Yeah. All that? Yeah. That's a kind of right And that's the side that he sewed. Look at it. This is some legitimate stuff here. I'm impressed. <laughs> Would you like a beer, Bumblebee? You want a beer? No, I don't want a beer. Maybe? Maybe? <laughs> no, not interested in the beer. berries all right so we ended up leaving that spot back there because it got real toasty real fast out there in the sunshine so we're gonna head into town and grab a few supplies then we're gonna go find a shady place to finish off the project I haven't been filming a whole lot he's been working his little butt off um, <laughs> Joseph is a pretty quiet worker he's uh, not a very very vocal person when he works so when it comes to filming it's more me doing the documentary style talking about what he's doing and I have no idea what he's doing <laughs> so we're gonna create a vlog out of this day uh, we're heading into town into Lillooet um, I want to go grab some things for uh, spray painting my van as yes I am going to attempt it what I'm gonna do with that is I'm actually gonna paint one panel at a time just to see how it works out what an amazing day it is here. Freaking a spectacular day to be on the road and traveling, that's for sure. All right. All right, grab myself another few cans of spray paint. I was hoping that they would have a case of spray paint, but they only had two more cans. This is the stuff that I used. You guys probably can't see it. This is the stuff that I used uh, to paint my bottom back quarter. And whoa, look how good that looks from here on the bottom. Crazy, right? Yeah. Check that out. I, look how shiny that is. Whoo! I did that with a, this dupla color acrylic enamel stuff for automotive. <laughs> mm -hmm. A little grocery shopping, some ice. Some cheese nips because they're freaking delicious. Some all beef wieners and a bag of buns. Probably gonna have a campfire tonight. Can't do a campfire. Oh, I forgot marshmallows. Decided that we're gonna go to the Seton Dam campground and find somewhere shady to finish off this big project. So let's hope one of my favorite spots are open. A little hot outside, buddy. <laughs> I know, it's a little warm. I met a subscriber of ours this morning who sent me a picture of her standing in the campsite at my one of my favorite campsites here, number eight. She's not here, but her tent is here. So I'm gonna go pop a sticker on it and claim it. <laughs> Found a great little spot. We're setting up sewing camp number two, 2.0. Sewing camp 2.0. The only difference between this camp and the last camp is we're going to power this one off of one of these little Jackery batteries. We're going to see if this little thing can run those sewing machines, both of them. What do you think? You think that's gonna run that one and that one? What do you say, Cruz? You think so? Yeah. The big moment of truth. Sewing machine number one and two are plugged into this, both of them into the Jackery. Moment of truth. Power on. Take a look at the stats before we start this job. It's at 100%. So 
So it's sitting at idle at 15 watts. It's because this thing has an old school light bulb. Look at that thing. <laughs> How old is this thing? Hold on. I bought it like 20 years ago and it's probably like a good 10 years old at that point. That's insane. Like 15 watts just sitting still. I think it's warm. Oh, it's warm too. <laughs> yeah. Thirty-seven watts. Okay, I'm gonna rip the pedal and see what happens. It actually pulled a less wattage going faster than it did going slower. Fifty-one wow. watts. That was it. Marking little spots. Do the snaps. Yep. Well, calm. That's where the zipper's gonna go. Yeah. Just try to hold it. For those of you who watched the other video when I was talking about what I wanted to do with the screens with the little doggy door, I decided not to do the doggy door and I'm just going to go with one zipper directly up the middle of the screen. So it's going to go right up the middle there and then when Cruz has his ramp in there, I'm just going to take unzip it part way and then fold that side in. That way Cruz can get in and out. Having the little doggy door seemed like a good idea when I was thinking about it, but then as of looking at it today, now that it's come to a point to actually do it. I was like, yeah, I think we're good with just one zipper. <sighs> I like sewing outside. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> it's like, yeah, it's great. I did it once on a deck with an extension cord. Yeah. And then it, that was, that was great. I loved it. But then I always dreamed of like coming out sleeping in your van or your truck and, and then just setting up shop in a campsite and be like, yeah, I'm gonna make something. That's sweet. Got everything we need for tonight. Marshmallows. Um, you have tequila? I got tequila. No yeah. more, that's it. That is a freaking perfect night. Except for I get to sleep without any bugs flying around. What about you? You got bug screens in the Jeep? No, I don't. Oh, oh yeah, by the way, he's sleeping in the Jeep. Like, literally, he built a platform. I'll show you guys tonight towards the end of it. But that dude is, like, literally sleeping in his Jeep. Yeah. Yeah, pretty cool. <laughs> oh snap look at that Whew. this is amazing <laughs> Still pretty impressed with this thing, man. I've owned this thing for what, over six months? And it rocks. We've been charging two cell phones on it, plus running the sewing machine, and it's at 80% left. Pretty impressive, man. He's sewing away, all plugged into it. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> what? Who are you laughing at? <laughs> um, funny thing is, is, uh, he just bought one of these jackeries from Amazon.ca. Um, yeah, pretty awesome. Um, they finally sell these babies in Canada now. <sighs> Too bad he didn't use my own like promo code because I would have got recognition for it, but he bought it before he even knew about that promo code wasn't available then, I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> it is now. So stoked. Full crank. It's reading 22 watts, 33 watts at a peak. 36. 52. So the slower you run that thing, the higher it runs for wattage. Um, I'm gonna leave the links to these things down below. Um, big fan, you won't be disappointed. Okay, done with the advertisement. Back to making zippers. Are you excited we're back to making zippers? Oh, zipper's done, yo. It's <laughs> in. We're gonna put it on the van now. Nice. 
he's done here is he's got snaps all along the inside and they just snap right into place. Woo, look at that. A super cool aspect of this too is as it goes down, he has it curved so it fits all the contours all the way through. Oh yeah, man. Awesome. Look at that. Easy access into the van. So awesome. Oh man. This, I can unzip it from the inside or the outside. Woo! Joseph, this rocks. <laughs> yeah. Just about a project complete. <laughs> Just about. Almost done. Almost done. Um, we don't have enough snaps to finish off the whole project. That's the problem when you're making stuff and you're way out on the freaking sticks like this and the local craft store doesn't open on the weekends at all. But that's okay. We'll get it fixed up, no big deal. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> now, nothing can bug you, bro. He's like, I like bugs. Bugs are fun to eat. You look pumped up, Chris. You look so excited. He's like, ugh, whatever. Oh, great. There were two fat guys having roasted marshmallows for dinner. Are you a roaster or do you just burn them? Oh, as a kid, I just burn them. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Roasting marshmallows at its finest. You just stick it in there until it catches fire. Marshmallow's done right. Cheers. <laughs> This is the second time I've recorded the ending to this video because when I hit record the first time, way back there in the background <laughs> was a naked man. This guy, buck naked, jumped in the river to have his dirty, nasty, just doing the wild man thing. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have a shower, so he jumped in the freaking night. This thing is cold. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching today's video, and um, yeah, we're done. That's it. Got anything else you want to say? I'm done. I'm done. Is it? I'm done, yeah. Okay. That's big, it. Okay, big question at the end. If somebody wants to buy custom made screens, will you make it for them? No. What about for money? Not even for money. <laughs> All right. We out. Going, buddy you're not going to my house that's for sure <laughs> sucker